YouTube, what's going on? It's Juan Gotti here. We another Washington Commanders video, and in today's video, I'm coming on here with a vlog from Martini's Bar and Lounge with the Washington Commanders. We'll be taking on the Dallas Cowboys, and I'm here hosting a live watch party um, in Fort Washington, Merlin. So make sure you guys like this video, subscribe if you're new. We're trying to get here early so we can set up things. I'm going to take you guys behind the scenes and the whole experience of today's game. So before we get into today's video, I ask you guys to do me a favor, like this video, subscribe if you're new, and turn on post notifications so you get notified when new content posted to the channel like this one. Let's get straight into today's video. You are now watching Juan Gaddy Talking Sports. About an hour away way again, like two hours of kickoff, the stage up there, you know what I'm saying? If you're not here in person, I hope you catch it on the live stream, but we're going to be having a good time. If people come, they come. If they don't, we're still going to have a good time and watch the watch the commanders hopefully get this big So you see what I'm rocking right now, man. I got the one guy talking sports with merch. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, I know you didn't think I was only going to be the one rocking it, man. I got a couple with me right now. A couple shirts that if you would have come to the event, you could possibly have a chance to win one of these. That's why you got to get down here at Monty. He's my man, 725K. So, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to my boy, Coach Jack in here. Austin the Sports King Shop. What's going on, Coach? You may as well go for the uniform, baby. Look at that. I like that look. Hey, let's move from the NFC. How about 15 minutes away from kickoff? What's good, Tyus? What you think we're going to do, man? Hey, hopefully it's that Carson Wentz from week one. <laughs> hopefully it's that Carson Wentz from week one. Y'all banking on him? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, man, I'm just happy it's not Dak. If it was Dak, we wouldn't have had a chance. I'm about to go throw Heineken in it. Uh, we lose today. We desperate. We desperate. We can't lose this day. We're going to go one and three. We cannot lose this game, ladies and gentlemen. We gotta win. Yeah. They lose like that today. They want to the suicide walk. About 10 minutes away from kickoff, man. Make sure you guys come through the stream. Share on the stream. Or if you're in this area, come through Martini's Bar and Oz, man. I'm here streaming the game. 725 County Drive is where we at. For Washington Berlin. Have a chance to win one of these. T-shirts I got. I want to get some sports T-shirt. Go up against the Cowboys fan coming up here to get the score for this. Let's see the score for this right here. Commanders win. No, Cowboys will win. 34-14. 14. You only got us getting 14 points. Wow. Wow, okay, okay. We're going to see. It's all the real crazy. We're going to see. We're going to see. Okay. Out of 34, Commanders 21. No. Oh. We got something for you coming out. I was going to get some merch before, but Walmart, they wanted $40 on this shirt. Yeah, I know. <laughs> but I got you. Who will throw the ball? Look, Cooper Rush pick right here. Cooper Rush out of the gun. Two receivers, two receivers to the right, none to the left, back in the backfield. <laughs> Rush takes a snap, draws back the pass, rolling out to his right, looking, looking, fires and throws it away. Third down coming up here, good defense. There we go. Third down. Third down. 53 yard attempt for Marner. Let's see if he misses it. Shake it. Shake it. Lucky this not in. Snap, hold. And it's good. So Dallas takes an early three point lead. Okay, that's not the worst. You know what I'm saying? We held him to three. Now Owen's got to come out and respond. 3-0 is your score. Dallas takes an early lead. Owen's got to come out here and respond. This team is unmotivated. 
zombies like the coach and stuff. Tell the people in there who say what's stuff on the chat. Wentz out of the gun and motion of the receiver. Two to the right, one to the left. Back in the back to Wentz takes the snap, drops back to pass. Looking, dumps it down for Gibson. Gibson gets about maybe three or four right there. That's one. Nice little pressure there. They walked up. Oh. Oh, that's, that's what they got them designed to do. They got them designed to drop back and far. When they clear, then they clearly know the offensive line is terrible and Dallas has a good pass rush. Why even had them at doing five to seven step drops? Quick three step drops, quick passes, quick game, get it going. Come on, man. It's not rocket science. Scott Turner just makes it harder than what it has to be. Now, Jonathan Allen with the sack. Now we're getting the ball right back. Let's go. Offense coming back on the field for this second possession. Jonathan Allen with the sack. Got the one guy he merged from the deck. You know what I'm saying? Look at the merge. Yes. One of the worst offensive coordinators in the league, man. Why would he why would he run on second and fifteen? That's what I'm saying. Even the only reason we still have in this. Kelly Boy's trade bus include that play calls your favorite Apple Originals on the most advanced Michael Carr you play at the MC. I wanna win y'all got it. And some law. Got a tension the ground and so don't get hyped, man. Hopefully the city girl's gonna get hyped about to send up the screen for Gibson out to the right and gets maybe about five. Come on, can the offense please wake up? That's another three and out right there. And we're gonna have good field position again. This offense gonna wake up eventually, man. Keep doing like he did last week, the play action. Don't got time to do that. No time to do play action things, man. I don't like Just like last week. I mean, even in Detroit, they was doing it. Even in Detroit, they was doing it. So we got to do some quick screens, some quick passes out. You know what I'm saying? We're doing good on the run part of it, but the penalty's killing us. Carson Wentz, intentional ground. Yeah. Uh, Chase really out for the year. Again, but we're getting Tyler. Larson back next week along with Brian Robinson versus Tennessee. So I'll, so we should be fine with that. But I mean, yeah, Scott Turner has to know that. He has to know. You got to get the ball out quick. It's no more long developing plays, especially with your offensive line looking like this and how good Dallas's line can be at times. So, I mean, it's the offensive coordinator at this point. It's coaching. We're two coming up here. One's trying to get the snap off, and he does. And he fires to the end zone. And it's tough! Touchdown for Madness, baby! Yeah. Jahan Dawson with the touchdown reception. It's the puck. Well, they for Carson Good ball in the back of the end zone. Touchdown commanders. Jahan Dawson with the reception. <laughs> Intercepted. Nice play by Forrest. All right, second and ten coming up here. Oh. Interception. That's a juice with the pick. There's a way. This is a Oh, it's a flag. Here we go. Oh, no. There's a flag. Wow. Oh, yeah. That's all y'all. Right, was it unnecessary, bro? <sighs> a legal contact while the quarterback was in the pocket. Who's there? there? When it takes a snap, quick pass out. There's no way. It was a minute and four seconds on the clock. Two timeouts. We run on first down and let the clock run out. Now it's like 20 seconds to go in the second quarter. That is the most conservative stuff I've ever seen in my life. This coaching stance is horrible. If, I, if, I'm, if, I, if I'm the coach, we got two timeouts left and a minute and four seconds left, and we get the ball coming out of the halftime, I'm going down to try to get points. This coaching staff is not good. I would try to go down and get points. There's no way you're that conservative and scared of this pass rush that you don't even try to get go down and get points. Snap, draws back pass, fires the end down. Oh, no! And it's a touchdown! 
what I tell you. I called. I called. I said two things would happen. You said my baby gonna throw what? Oh, okay, my bad. I just had to check to see if you remember. That's number two. That's not even Terry though. That's number two. Why are you throwing? Why are you throwing it to Jahan Johnson? All right, boys, so 12 to 17 is your score at halftime, man. Cowboys are up. I'll first start by saying the positive defense has been playing well. Uh, they really haven't done anything but got that last touch out of Michael Gallup. Offensive side of the ball, outside of that one possession that where we scored, which has been bad. Scott Turner play calling is horrible. You got two timeouts and a minute and four seconds left. There's no way you should be that conservative. There's no way. You don't touch the offense, and then you throw a bomb to John Dawson, not even turn the form. Come on, it don't make sense, but the offense has to wake up. Defense playing solid. Defense, defense is playing well enough for us to win. If the offense could wake up and match their intensity, Dallas wouldn't even have a chance for us. But that's the quick uh, halftime report. See you guys in the third quarter. Playing the second half and the ball. This play calling is horrible. They don't get it. They don't think. So there goes a loss of two, second and 12 coming up here. So Stacey Snap draws back the pass. Looking, fires across the middle of the field. Ties caught for the first down. Curtis Samuel with the reception. First down, Washington. Let's go. That's what happens when you give them time, man. Get it. We need a new offensive coordinator. We need a new offensive coordinator. Need to hire you, bro. Huh? Need to hire you. Hire me, bro. There's no way you you run the ball well in the first half, and you run the ball well in the first half. You don't think Dallas was gonna go in the locker room and say, okay, let me stop, let's stop the run. Then you're gonna come out and run the ball again, but they weren't gonna stop it. Switch it up, bro. He does. He's not creative, but his situational play calling has to be the worst. Let's go. We about to run it. Hey, Dallas, here, run this kick back, baby. Go with it. Hey, Juan. Dax Mill, run this kick back. Come on. Fourth and 12. Can we get some pressure right on the punt? Oh! Almost blocked. Mill got some, got some room to work with. Cut it back inside. No. Run that ball. Go that way. Why are you coming back to the sideline? All right. We got good field position anyway. We got a score right here. Play action fake, dumps it down, and it goes no Nah, it's because, listen, Terry cooks him every play and he acts like he's good. He cocky. I don't like people that's cocky, man. I like humble people. Nah, I'm talking about with Terry, though. He... It's because I'm a quarterback. I ain't got to get to him. Diggs is a really good ball hook, but he's not a shutdown corner. All right, so Washington moved the chain. That's good enough for another Washington first down, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. I ain't gonna lie. I love Jared Patterson. I don't know if he does that. Hey, coming up here. Come on, y'all. One takes a snap, or is about to take a snap on the center. Wake up. Snap. Play action fake. Looking. Wake looking. Throws it. And all right, third and eight throws it away. All these penalties killing every job. Nine penalties for seven and a half So many of these penalties. Slide, snap. It's good. And it's good. All right, Washington at least gets three. So 10 to 15 is your score. Come on, defense. Give me a stop, defense. A lot of time on the clock. Hey, Juan, you know I gotta mess with you, Rocky. Hey, look, he didn't even say nothing on the podcast. He just sit there like that. Touchdown, CD Lambs. 22. Just wide open down the seams, huh? Like, how is he just wide open down the middle of the field? Got Turner out there. Got Turner out there. Got Turner out there. Got Turner out there. Got Turner First and ten coming up here. Wentz out of the gun. Quick pass out. Samuel trying to get the edge again, and he does, and he gets out of bounds. We're losing 22 to 10. Scott Turner score. Offense line score. One and three, more likely than that.
On third and three, you're going to run the ball, bro. You mentioned that Michael Parsons, Nate Van Der Esch were both right in the A-gaps. They don't want to win, bro. I, they gave, I swear they gave, they gave up, bro. They gave up. And now he's punting. Now they're punting. They gave up, bro. That's game. They gave up. They gave up. They gave up, bro. Man, look at these Cowboys fans, bro. As you see early in the video, they didn't have on none of that stuff. But as soon as they start winning, they want to put on their ugly Cowboy jerseys, man. I'm telling you, bro. They got away with one this time. I can't wait to see them for round two at the crib. <laughs> Pass the ball. It's no way. He's old. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Literally. Take him out the game. Everybody, make everybody else beat him. That's real life. Flag. He all over my man. Back and all that. He didn't let him come out his break. Come on, second and five coming up, bro. Come on. You got to score. Snap, Wentz looking. Fires to the end zone. And it's caught. They say he wasn't in bounds. Incomplete. She got the same man. Offense is horrible, man. Scott Turner's bad. Offensive line is bad. Carson Wentz is bad, man. Defense, they tried. They kept us in this game for a long time, and offense couldn't get nothing going, man. So, Washington Commanders fall to one and three on the season, one and two on in the division. It's not looking like anything's changed, man. The same old Commanders, man. Uh, cross me one time, that's gonna get you pop Get you pop, uh, get you drop uh, Slide on the one where that get you rock